Hello everyone, welcome to Proud Animator. In this video, we are going to learn how to animate a 3D building rotation in After Effects without using any plugin. So let's start. Before jumping onto animation, let's check out the illustration and the layer separations. So this is the illustration we are going to be working on in today's lesson. And this is how the layers are separated. Okay, so let's jump on to After Effects. So right now, we are going to select Shades and Body Layer and convert it into 3D layer by clicking over here. And we are going to turn on two views by clicking on two views. So right now, I'm going to select this view and convert it into top view. Now there are more options, you can even convert it into change it into front view, left view, back view, or bottom or right view. And there are also another option, which is four views. But for this one, we only need two views. One is default one and one is the top view. Okay, so right now we are going to make a cube out of this body layer. So right now, let's turn off the visibility of shades. And I'm going to copy the body layer once again and open the rotation and give 90 degree of rotation on Y axis. And I'm going to move this layer and put it at the corner. So don't worry about this moving downwards. We will fix it later on. So right now we are going to focus on only on this view. So we are going to select it and put it at this corner to snap it. At the corner, press and hold control key. So I'm going to copy this layer once again and I'm going to move the anchor point and snap it over here by pressing and holding control key. And then I'm going to rotate it and give it 90 degree of rotation. And then again, copy it once again and move the anchor point and put it at this point and give it a 90 degree of rotation. So which is 270. Okay. So let's fix this view right now. So we are going to open the selection key and only move it in Y axis. And just put it like this. All right, so we are going to select all these body layers and pull it above in the Y axis. Okay, so let's turn on the shade layer. So let's turn off the visibility. Okay, now we are going to put the shade layer over here. So we need to move the shade layer a bit upwards in Y axis. All right. So we are going to do the same with the shade layer as well. So let's copy the shade layer once again. And I'm going to rotate it by 90 degree. So let's put the anchor point over here and right now Let's snap it with this corner. And then again, I'm going to copy it and move the anchor point to this corner. And let's open the rotation and give a rotation of 180. And then copy it once again and move the rotation and put it over here. Sorry, the anchor point and rotate it by 90 degrees, which is 270. All right, now we are going to select the shade layers and just center it. Okay. Now we can turn off two views and we can just turn on the default view only. So right now, we are going to add a null layer over here. Now I'm going to change the position of the anchor point and put it at this point. 
and let's move the position of the anchor point and put it at the center of this ground layer so right now we are going to select all of these layers and before that convert the null layer into a 3d layer then select all this layer and parent it with null layer and let's open the rotation and right now here your 3d rotation of the building is complete so we just only need to put a keyframe on the y-axis and let's jump on to next 20 frames and give it one and at the zero frame let's give it zero degree of rotation and let's add a loop expression which is loop in plus loop out minus the value okay so that's two first so let's slow it down yeah now our rotation animation is done let's delete this ground layer now let's scale it down a bit now we can even add a light on this layer so we are going to add a light so let's give it parallel light and i'm going to give it white and press ok so right now you can see there is a 3d effect that has been added over here so i am providing the source file of this project you can get it from the link in the description and that is it for this lesson Hope you liked it. If you liked it, then make sure to hit the like button. If you have any doubt regarding the lesson, make sure to comment down. I will be happy to help you out. And if you are here for the first time, make sure to subscribe the channel and hit the bell notification button to stay notified for all the future updates. Until then, goodbye.